MajorCommand.com. Seriously, kick ass strategy gaming. What's up, people? Bedorty's here. Uh, so, you've gotten yourself into a game. I'm going to show you how to take a basic turn. If you've already played similar games, uh, conquest type games, you know, you're already halfway there. It's, it's really pretty simple. So, this is the game that I'm in. It's in round one, as I can see up here. I am Bedorty's. This is my color, it's black. If I mouse over myself, it'll highlight all the regions I have. Uh, same with the other people as well. You can change your color as well uh, just by clicking here and changing your color to whatever you like. Uh, I'm always black. That's just the color I like. So there's three stages to each turn. There's deployment, assaulting, and reinforcement. And when you click the begin turn button, then you're in the deployment stage. It says you have three troops to deploy. So I'm going to choose which region I want to deploy at. Um, I think I'm strong in South America here, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to deploy, I'm going to click on Piranha. Uh, it's red, so that means my mouse is over it. I'm going to click it once. And it brings up how many I want to deploy. I can use a slider. Uh, I can use these numbers. Basically, I'm just going to deploy all of them there and click Deploy. I can deploy one there, one somewhere else. Basically, you just got to use them up. When you're done deploying all your troops, you'll be in the assault phase. That's why it says end assault. Click the regions you want to assault to and from. Uh, this help screen will you know, provide some more helpful information. I usually keep it off because I already know what to do. So right here, now I'm in the assault phase. I'm going to click the region I want to assault from. And then the region I want to assault to. There's actually only one I can assault to. The other ones are owned by myself. I can't assault myself. So I'm going to assault Bolivia here. I'm going to click it. Brings up the assault screen. One is like one dice throw if you click assault. Uh, when you blitz, it means you just continually throw the dice until you either win or lose. I'm going to do it once. Uh, the fire means you've won. Basically, you match it up with the highest roll. Five to four, I win. Four to three, I win. And he's down to one. I still have six. I'm going to go again. And I won again. Six beats his one. Now I can choose how many people I want to move in there. Um, let's see. You can move this screen around by dragging it. Uh, I already have a border here. So I'm actually going to move them all in. And let's see. I'm just going to take another chance. I'm going to go five to four with Peru. See what happens. Oh, that's good. And I'm going to do it one more time. And I'm all in again. And I'm going to just click the All button. And that just moves them all. That's if you're doing, you know, quick turns. So that's, that's it for the Assault phase. And I'm going to end my Assault there. Click End Assault. And now I'm in the Reinforcement phase. If you check the Brief tab, it'll tell you what type of reinforcement there is. There's one and its path. So let's see, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to bring, I'm going to click Klondike and I can only bring it to Pacifica, so I'm going to click Pacifica and I'm only going to put one in there. I'm just going to click Reinforce. And it moves it in and that is the end of my turn. It is now Gamakichi's turn. Uh, this person has 24 hours. Uh, I click Jump the next, we'll go to my next turn. That's pretty much the basics of how to take a turn here. There's lots more to do with this interface, and if you click this link here, I'll run down what all these different things are, so that's probably your next step. Good luck. Magcom.